Hey guys, how you doing? Um, I'm doing a quick review of the Divine Viewer headset today. And I'm going to show you guys what came in the package. I got the headset and some like 3M padding strips. Don't need those. I got like microfiber, cleaning cloth, that's okay. And instruction manual, but I uh, don't really need that. It's simple. So looking at the headset, it looks like it's pretty good quality. Um, it's got these head straps here. These things are like uh, Velcro. Um, you got one there, two on the side, and then it's got some padding here. It's actually like a bit cushiony. It's pretty nice, and um, haven't tried it out yet, so we're gonna see what it's like. Uh, it's got padding here, and then you can see like the lenses are in there, um, and then you got adjustments. Um, on the side here, so this one makes the stage go in and out like that, I guess, for the depth adjustment. And then there's uh, this one on the top, which does the interpupillary distance. Um, let's try that out. So see, it moves the, the lenses side to side. Um, and then if you open it up, you see the uh, smartphone tray and how this works is it's got like little um, spring-loaded uh, things there on the top and the bottom. It's got like little rubber pads too, so it, it's you know safe to put your phone in. Um, and then the phone just goes in there. Uh, so I just got like regular iPhone 6, put it in there like that, and it sits nice. It doesn't fall out or anything. And then the other cool thing it has is. Um, it's like magnetic, so it doesn't have like a little button. Like I've seen other ones have buttons and uh, sometimes they get stuck, but this one's pretty good because you can close it and then just snaps and like, you know, it's good. Um, so that's pretty much it. I'm gonna go and uh, download an app and put it on and try it out. So hang on a sec. So one of my friends told me to get the uh, it's supposedly like Discovery VR. It's supposed to be an app from Discovery. So I'm going to download that. Let that download. <clears throat> Should take a few seconds. Okay, it's going. Okay, I'm going to open that up. Uh, no, I don't want notifications. I don't think anybody does. Um, okay, so then I got some different things to pick from. I'm going to choose this one. Protecting ocean anchor species. So you hit play on this, and then you switch it over to the Google Cardboard mode. Um, I think I got to switch. Yeah, I got to do that. There we go. One. Okay. Cool. So you put this in here, I guess. And then that's it. So the idea is that it splits and you can already see like it's doing the tracking. Like if I turn it, the image, and then what it does is it's like those old viewers, it splits like each eye sees a different image. So like your left and right eye, and then it, your eyes just see a different image. So you get um, depth perception. And plus it does like the full 360 degree tracking. So I'm gonna try it out. Now, I know you guys can't see me right now, but um, just taking a look. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty nuts. The head tracking works good. Um, it's comfortable on the head, like the straps. I guess the default position is fine for me. But uh, yeah, I think I could wear it for a reasonable amount of time. And it's, it's light, it's not heavy or anything. And, and the field of view is pretty good. And, yeah, the head tracking is quick. You can look back and forth. There's not much lag in it, so it's good. Yeah, so overall, I'd probably give it like a maybe like a nine, nine and a half out of ten. It's good. Definitely recommend picking one up if you haven't tried uh, virtual reality. Yet. It's a pretty cheap way to get in, and, and there's like you know thousands of. Uh, VR apps to try out. But yeah, that's it. Divine Viewer. Check it out. Thanks. Bye.